Breakfast Show with Nick Grimshaw. Get up! Oh, good morning, Adele. Hello, hello, hello. 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 Good morning, Troy Savan. Good morning, how are you? Wake yourself up. Good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday morning. It's just gone 8 a.m. on the Radio 1 Breakfast Show. And our guest is here. Good morning, Lord. Hello there. How are you doing? Hello there. <laughs> I'm really good. How are you? I'm good. Hey, thank you for coming in to see us. No worries. Anytime. It's been a little while. It's been a minute. I was trying to think of the last time I saw you and I can't remember. I think the last time that we saw each other was you put your wet finger in my ear. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this is going to follow me until I die. It was dry. I just want oh, to say. It was, it was dry. It was still it was shocking. dry willy. <laughs> I apologize. It was still <laughs> shocking to have the finger of Lord in my ear. It's not good. I'm so sorry. It was a real surprise. Yeah. And really, it's, whenever I see you now, no matter how cool your performance is or how great your music video is, you I'm just like, think of that. She put a finger in my ear. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, Lord is our guest this morning on the Radio on Breakfast Show. We're going to be chatting more after these three songs. Radio 1 Breakfast Show with Nick Grimshaw. Okay, Tuesday morning, it is quarter past eight and we have Lord with us. Good morning. Hello there, how's it going? I'm really good. It's so nice to have you on the show because I remember remember when you first came on. Mm -hmm. When was it, Fifi? 2012, 2013? Yeah. Something like that. 16. With 16 years old. Baby. I know. I remember you sat there. Yeah. Your mum was here. My mum's still still here. She hasn't moved. Oh, wow. She's actually (laughs) still in reception. Yeah, she's just been She just loves this building. (laughs) (laughs) Does she come everywhere and have a nice time or does she particularly enjoy the Radio 1 Breakfast Show with Nick Rimshaw? She deeply enjoys coming to the BBC. BBC building. Uh-huh. Um, she does come to a lot of places with me, yeah. So it's nice to have a bit of mum energy around. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> Our mums won't even listen to us on the radio. Your mum doesn't listen to you. She'll occasionally listen. It's a novelty listen. worn off. Yeah. I don't hear from Nick every day, just yeah. some days. Yeah, she's like, I don't need it in real life and on the radio. <laughs> right? Yeah. But I yeah. heard your mum, your mum's keeping your like keeping your scrapbook and your memories together like she keeps all your passes for everywhere she yeah she does she does keep a lot of my passes yeah she definitely looked wolfishly at the BBC pass this morning and I teased her about it um <coughs> yeah she she keeps everything which is so great I feel like one day I've got to uh, yeah. make some sort of like weird quilt <laughs> yeah really weird quilt with your your, your history on yeah. yeah and pass it on to your children and mm, be like yes. here's some BBC passes Earlands. on a Tuesday yeah <laughs> Just what you wanted. Mm-hmm. Um, we've got to talk about green light because this is when people talk about like a comeback or like I'm back. They you know don't really. Sometimes it don't happen. This song feels like a smack in the face. Green light doesn't oh, it? It feels like yeah. a whole new chapter for Lord. It definitely feels like I'm back, everybody. <laughs> right, thank you. Was that a conscious decision to to come back with like a, a huge banger, or was this just what happened when you went into the studio? I mean. It's interesting because even when the song was just like on piano, it felt exactly the way it feels now. Um, it was born so kind of such electricity to, to even the demo. Um, and it felt like the start of the chapter of the record. So for that reason, I was like, it's a nice place to start. But also I feel like, and I love it, but a lot of the music on the radio is like very chill these days. It's uh-huh. cool. It's very cool to be very chill. And I was like quite chill, you know, Royals was like very slow. And I was like, you know what? I I, I don't feel like being chill. I'm, I, I feel like being a psycho and just bursting back and being like, here it is, all of it. This is everything that I've been feeling. It's very fast. It's got yeah. a bizarre Euro piano behind it. Deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> I like that though. I like the the sort of the, the, the passion in it and the pace yeah, into it. I think, yeah, it feels feels good. Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> it really does feel good. Um, did you like go into the studio after, you know, the success of your, your first album? That must have been a whole different process going into to write. So did you, because oh, yeah. obviously you, you, you didn't have the success before the first one and they always say like the second one is like the difficult second yeah. album. Yeah, yeah. How did you attack it? Like how did you go, did you go and sit down and be like, today I write an album or were you always writing? Like how, did, how does it happen for you? I mean, you want to be able to do it like that. I sort of, I mean, there's a reason I theft around for two and a half years. It did take me a while uh-huh. to, to get it right, but um. No, I mean, I think that you have an idea of what an album will be when you start, and to look back on that picture at the end, it's always very, very different. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I definitely didn't know I was going to make 
this record influenced by all this music that I was dancing to every night, you know, but but he but he did and I, I'm glad that I don't. So is that, that what happened? Coming. You had time off, went dancing, and then I was like, I'm gonna make a dance so banger. Much. Yeah, it was like I just I'm gonna make all this music that's like that vibe. Yeah. <laughs> well should we what hear it? Yeah, go for it. Okay, let's do it. Lord is here, our guest this morning on the Radio on Breakfast show. This is Green Light. I do my makeup in somebody else's car. We ordered different Lord and Green Light on BBC Radio One and Lord is here with us this morning. That sounds good, doesn't it, on the radio? Oh, man, I was just saying, I haven't uh, really listened to the song on the radio before. It sounds so good. It sounds good. You're like, it's it's all weird. you guys. Something you're doing is Yeah, yeah, fun. it's all us. It's the way I introed it. Yes, <laughs> that's, yes. that's what made it's it that. sound good. It's that. When you made that and it was all finished, like, do you go and play that to people and be like, do you want to hear my new massive banger that's going <laughs> to be a hit all over the world? Like, Do you know that, are you, are you confident when you made that that, that was going to sound good on the radio? You definitely have no idea. And a lot of people were telling me, um, what was wrong with the song? Why the song wouldn't work? What were I was those getting a reasons? lot of mixed responses because the first time you listen to it is very confusing. Yeah, it's, there's a key change mid song. You know, this piano comes in. And I think a lot of people were just like, um, I think I like it. I can't really tell. <laughs> um, which was stressful, as you can imagine, having not put anything out in three years for people to be like, I don't know I, if this is good or not. Yeah, they're like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. But no, I, 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 it's, it's been cool. Yeah, it was. I, I know. I was just so prepared for everyone to hate it. Um, How do you? play music to people because it's always a weird thing oh i, I, I avoid it to the, to the 11th hour nick i'm like i'm i can't do this i my friends and loved ones hear things maybe even after they come out my oh, really? family heard it a little right. while before they had it on their ipods and they were dancing to it at home but yeah i i don't because it's embarrassing listen yeah. to this thing that i've made there's never a, the perfect moment to put on your own to transition from other people's <laughs> music to your own in the socials should we put this on should, should we, we listen put to me my on? Song? Should we do should we listen to me yeah Suck it is it. quite a weird thing i'm glad that you said that because that happens occasionally with me where guests come on and it happened lady gaga came in when she played uh perfect illusion uh-huh. and she's like do you want to hear some of the albums so i was like i'd love to hear some of the albums oh, yeah. thinking maybe she'll email it me so then she took me into that room over oh there yes yeah, and yeah. played it to me and just looked at me like yes and i, yeah. I have to do that fake like I'm listening face like mm, well, it's hard yeah. to, I, like yeah. that bit it's so, <laughs> it's so awkward I, so I'm glad I, that you well, said it's that. O- more awkward for me I think because yeah. I just think that everything I do is terrible I'm so <laughs> I mean I know it's not I, I love it but it's yeah it takes me a second to get there yeah well I guess you, you can't be like this is amazing everybody everybody yeah, listen no, no. to it what about like your peers in music because you're friends with like you know the Heim girls and friends with Taylor and stuff do you do you call them or is that even weirder because they're doing the same job or is that nicer because they're doing the same job for, for musical advice um i mean i kind of don't really operate from a place of like listening to a lot of advice just because i'm like when it's right it's right for me yeah. my brain and what i'm going through at the moment there's probably a better way of doing it but to me this feels right um but it's definitely nice to to especially when you know i've been on a break for a long time to just check in with other musicians and be like how, how are you doing differently with the home girls it was like we've kind of been making our second records yeah the at same the same time, time. Yeah. so we'd have dinner every couple months and be like you're doing all right you're in, you're in the trenches how you're many all... tracks yeah, yeah. You, are you <laughs> happy you uh, you eating well was, uh, yeah. <laughs> i really want to hear that that yeah. home record oh it's all i want have life. you heard anything I heard a little bit a long time ago. I'm <gasps> very excited. The Me day too. it comes out, I'm putting aside the day. They're, they're going to smash it. They're going to smash think it. They're so wonderful. It, I find, like, not that I'm like your mum or anything, but I like it that you're friends with Haim and that you're in the same career. I it's, like well, that you have each cute. other. We, yeah. our, our families have hung out at one point. Her, their mum and dad... And my mum, we've, we've all kind of spent time together. I so like it's that. Quite sweet to think about. It's like very familial yeah. vibe. And I guess it's going to be good. Like if you are both on like festival circuits yeah. together. Do you know what you're doing for the summer yet? Do we have any festivals? I know you're doing Coachella. I'm doing Coachella. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm doing a bunch of. Stuff. It's a big one at Coachella as well. A big one at Coachella. One. That's the first one. <laughs> Is it? Oh, Will you be nervous for that? Do you get nervous? Oh boy! Like oh yes, a lot of rescue remedy. Do you guys have rescue remedy? Here? Yeah, we have mm. that. <laughs> yeah. Indulge in a bit of rescue remedy. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm doing a... I'm so excited to start talking about it. And I know I'm not allowed to talk about anything that I'm doing yet. Okay. <laughs> Phoebe's really gonna... pushing me on this. She's wrote, just wrote down, any UK ones? 
We Listen, can't talk what about I can them, say can is that there are definitely UK ones. I, there they, we go. They, I'm popping my little head out. It's about when and where, and you'll have to wait to find out. Okay, <laughs> that's good because lots of people this morning are, are are really excited about you performing live. Oh man, I love and performing here. Alice has said, "When are you gonna tour in England? Do we know?" Um. Oh, proper tour. I mean, it's, I think it's another thing. Someone's going to be standing behind us being like, yeah, don't, yeah, don't yeah, talk yeah. about yeah, These things are planned. But it's, but it's, listen, it's, they're definitely... You like they're, it? Here. They're in my eye cow. Oh. It's all, it's all teed up. So all we have to do is hack it, her eye cow. <laughs> Whoa! No! <laughs> just kidding, I'm just kidding. Don't say that on I'm the I'm just air. kidding. Uh, Louisa, 12-year-old Louisa says, I love Lord. <gasps> um, is she going to go on tour? Yes, Louisa, oh, she is. It's so in her cute. eye cow. Uh, and hello to Evie on her way to school as well, saying I love Lord so much as so amazing. Oh, that is so sweet. Yeah. Little nice, mates. That, isn't it? Little mates there, all excited <laughs> for the tour. But confirmation, she's going to be doing something somewhere. That's an exclusive, guys. Yes, there we <laughs> what a <laughs> scoop. <laughs> Something's happening somewhere. Yeah. Um, hello to Don, who's been on, saying, first time I am hearing Lord speak. Oh, <laughs> hi, Don. How are you doing? Even her spoken voice is super musical. Oh, interesting. <laughs> says, says Don. And right. by the way, loved your performance on Saturday Night Live. Best oh. I've seen in a long time. Oh, thanks, guys. That was great, wasn't Everyone it? Everyone is so nice today. I had the best time on Saturday Night Live. It is so much fun. Um, and I had a great week Scarlett Johansson was hosting which is That's such good. a treat she's hosted five times wow she's I great I imagine hosting the one time yeah. I have no comic timing <laughs> I, I, I already if they ever ask I mean it's doubtful that they'll ask but I'm like I can't do it I can't, <laughs> like, I can't. sing fine like lead balloon it would just be the end <laughs> for me and Saturday Night as a working Live. professional yeah. <laughs> but the performance <laughs> super fun the performance would be wonderful <laughs> so, um, I want to talk to you about another show as well because mm. you're a big fan of Saturday Night Live but I hear also you've become recently a big fan of this. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's just so cozy hearing that. So cozy. Oh. Oh. I'm seeing the opening shot. Oh, I'm the smelling the cakes. I'm dreaming of a tent in a field. The tent. And Mary Berry, God bless her. Ah, isn't so she a rock star? She's the best. I think she's my new favourite person. Uh, hello, yeah. I'm obsessed with her. And I had this thought, I was like, maybe her and the Queen of Friends. Do you think? Don't you think they would, like, kick it? <laughs> Mary Berry and the Queen. <laughs> it's not, it's not, it's not impossible. It's not, not, it's not it. a crazy <laughs> thought. It's not a crazy thought. We don't know if they've met, we'll do some research we'll into it. But I'm, if they've not, they should be BFFs. Listen guys, I'm happy to hook you up on a friend date. Yeah. Don't worry You know the it. Queen very well. <laughs> you know Mary Berry very well. <laughs> yeah. Just makes sense. I'm just obsessed with this show. Me too. I can't, I'm so grateful that I found it. I have no idea what about it makes it so incredible. But it's something, it's so cozy, it's very funny, it's very endearing. All these people from all these walks of life, I feel how people must feel watching American Idol. <laughs> <laughs> so nice. Who's going to win, the old man or the young child? It's, it's amazing, it's like American know. Idol with cakes or Gorgeous. something. Gorgeous. <laughs> Um, well, we're going to chat more to Lord, uh, probably about the Great British Bake Off. <laughs> um, after the news, it's 8.32. Here's Tina Dahili. This is BBC Radio 1. MBC. Morning, everybody. It's 8.39. We have Lord with us this morning. Good morning. Hello. I've prepared you something. Talk to me. What's you know, going on? You know you like music and you like cream eggs. Yeah. I've got something special for you after this. When you're low and your knees can't rise Okay, 8.42 Tuesday morning, we have Lord with us. Good morning. Hi. Hi, Lord. Um, since we've, you know, played those songs and we've had the news, we have, uh, by the way, everybody, just spoken about the Great British Bake Off. <laughs> that's it. That's all that's going on. How are we feeling about Noel Fielding on the Great British Bake Off? I am very excited. I love the Mighty Boosh. Yeah, love. Um, obviously, it's a change in tone. I'm excited to see what he does with the art form that is Great British Bake Off. I hope it's super weird. 
I think it's going to be pretty weird. And yeah. he's going to wear some crazy outfits in the tent. Eh? Yeah, sort of cake-inspired looks yeah. for no fielding. Probably. We've got to get him on the show. We've not had him on for ages. We should have had him on today. I could we should have. We grilled him about, uh, yeah, him about what the hell was going on. It's incredible. Yeah. Um, okay, you, we should wa- be a, you should be a guest star on the Great British Bake Off. I, hello, and you should. Do they have guest stars? We should enter it. Should we? We know no fielding. Let's we can text it. <laughs> okay, exclusive. Me and Lord contestants. Perfect. On the Great British Bake Off. What else do you like to watch? Because I imagine when you're, you know, you've got this summer ahead of festivals, you're going to oh, yeah. have to be stocked on like box oh, yeah. sets and stuff. A lot of tour TV. Yeah. So um, Bake Off, obviously. Love Bake Off. Yeah. Love, um, and really into Big Little Lies at the moment. Oh, I've not seen that yet. Oh, it's that, good. No. They are good. I need to see it's that. It's just so good. I need um, to see that. What else is awesome? I feel like I I love that show Love on Netflix. Oh, I've not seen that either. It's cool, it's really good. I'm still watching Bake Off. Check that one out. Um, and also, I hear your go-to snack. We saw you tweet about this. Is you love a cream egg? I listen. It gets to Easter time, and I love to indulge in a cream mm-hmm. egg. And I've been in America, and the chocolate is not very good. Yeah, America, I've heard so that. I was excited to come to the UK and snack on a little <laughs> cream egg, and I can see actually. Am I allowed to? Uh, yeah. Pull these into Look the Look at that. Somebody's brought me a l- 10 cream eggs. I've also stole two. You there's, stole two. There's, there's 12, so but I need two. Because they have got smaller, I feel, this year. Do I? Can I? Shall I yeah, have let's a little, try one. I mean, it's very early in the morning to be yeah. eating cream eggs. I think it's only going to enhance the interview, I, I feel. I, it can only. Now, if these got smaller go or if my hands got bigger. Because I remember when they were little, when I was little, <laughs> I could never finish one. But now... Okay, I'll two of them. Mm. Mm. I mean, what is that stuff in the middle? It's I not good for you. Mm. <laughs> what is it? You get your tongue in there and you hit the orange. Mm-hmm. That's the money. Mm-hmm. I don't know what it is, but I like it. Oh, yeah. God, that's wow, rich. That's that good. is rich. <laughs> wow. Very wow. rich. <laughs> oh, wow, I'm not going to sleep till Friday. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, because you like cream eggs so much, um, and we like green light so much, I thought I'd do you a trade-off, basically. Okay. Because you've written songs for us, for the world. But <laughs> yeah. has anyone ever written a song for Lord? I don't think so. Well, hello. I'm terrified. No, What's don't about be to terrified. happen? <laughs> we basically combined um, two of our favourite things in March: green light and also cream eggs. Oh my god! Are you ready for this? <laughs> I, I don't know. Am I? <laughs> you have some lyrics in front of you. Oh gosh! Okay. Oh my god, that was good. That was good, eh? Should we just end the interview here? Mm. I don't think we can top that. Mm. Mm. Um, but I thought we could sing a song based on Green Light, all about your love of cream eggs. <laughs> Do you hate this? I listen. I hate it. No, I love it. I love it. <laughs> let's you, let's if, give it a try. Okay, let's give God, it. God, these lyrics are. Quite good. Yeah, do you like them? I, I do. Thank I'm you. Impressed. We can work together if you want. Is the album finished? Um, we're getting real close. Well, let's squeeze another track in. Okay. <laughs> Bonus track. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Don't have that because we're gonna sing. Okay. <laughs> she really likes cream eggs. It's so delicious. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. So why don't we do line for line? Oh God. Should okay. we do that? Okay. Should I start? Do we have any instrumental backing? Hello. We've got the green Hello. light brackets breakfast cream egg edits. Oh my god. Instrumental. Here we go. I rip off all the foil before I leave the shop. I've waited all this time and now I just can't stop. Oh wow, your voice is good. <laughs> and oh wait. I need them all year round. I wanna scream the truth. I said I'd have just one, I'm such a damn liar. <laughs> the white cream, it tastes so sweet. When you bite it, thought you said you would never, never make a mess. But now there's egg on your face. Did it frighten you? How you always seem to want just one more. Oh, you want one more? But I have have the egg on on my my mind. mind. It's great lyrics, great lyrics. All All the the eggs eggs in my mind. But honey, I'll look out out for them wherever I go. But honey, I'll search every shop, down every road. I'm waiting for it. Just let go. I'm waiting for it. That 
I'm so sorry to everyone. <laughs> Anything I've ever witnessed ever. That was better than Saturday Night Live in your <laughs> face. We did quite well. We did quite well. That was a good song. I enjoyed oh, the journey of this. Yeah, thing. that was really nice. We really, we really worked together. Mm. Very organic. We're very organic. We should get in the studio. Between getting on the British Bake Off and mm-hmm. no fielding. writing a tune, I think yeah. we're going to be spending some time together. I right. can't stop eating this cream. Yeah, it's no. so delicious. I think so. Okay, well, let's have some all-time low um, and just stuff our faces. Um, Lord, thank you for coming on. <laughs> thank you so much for having me. Great to see you. I'll see you in the studio this afternoon. Yes. We'll write that album together. Pop to Bake Off. Yeah, it's be great. perfect. <laughs> I don't believe in saints.